In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix a problem when you're creating a user account in the Microsoft 365 Admin Center and you get an error message saying we are preparing a mailbox for the user and the user can't log in to their mailbox and get, you get, they get error messages. So let me show you how to fix that. I'm going to try to replicate it first and then I'll show you how to fix that. So let me show you, I'm going to create a, an account. I'm going to add user, test, test. So this will be a test user. I'm just going to put any password here. Next. Uh, I'm just going to sign in a license. Just, and then just going to take all defaults. Now we should have created a mailbox as well. But let me see if it's going to display the error message. So it's saying we're preparing a mailbox for the user. You may have seen some documentation said that it might take 24 hours, but that's not true. It's actually something that's stopping it. So this, I'm going to show you the cause. Basically, if you go to identity, so once you're in identity, go to users and there is a tab here for deleted users. And the likely problem is that you've had an account with the same email address that you've deleted and it's just sitting in the deleted users tab. So what you need to do is to permanently delete that. But what you need to do first is go back to the active users in the admin center. So in the admin center, just delete the user. Then what you need to do is go back to the identity and then go to users and deleted users. Now in here, just select them all and then just delete permanently. Now once it's deleted permanently, just uh, refresh the page to make sure it has been deleted. Just give it a few seconds, just refresh and they're all gone now. Then just go back into active users. Now just uh, create a user, give the same details, test, test, and test again. Just give it a password. Just say next, assign a license. Add that in. Okay, go to active users. Now go to mail and yep. Once you see this information here and you see the mail storage, the account has been created and you can log in with this account. You can also go to the exchange admin. And you will see it here. If this video helped you in any way, please give a like and subscribe to the channel.